Hey guys, what's up? This is Blaze the Moving and I got something to say to you. In January of 2012, I will be making five commentaries on five different people. Keep in mind that all of those five videos have one thing in common. They're all old videos. I already decided which videos I am going to commentate on. And I will be commentating on a video each Monday. So look out for those five commentaries. Why am I making this video? I could easily just make an article on Blogspot announcing that I'm going to make five commentaries. Why am I announcing it in a video instead of my Blogspot account? Well, because this isn't just a video where I tell you that I will be making five commentaries in January. I also have some questions for you guys. But first, I am going to tell you why I plan on only making five commentaries in January. Because I only want to take a few steps at a time. Besides, I have other videos in mind for January that I am also going to work on. Anyway, enough of that. I have some questions for you guys. My first question is, what is the best way to make commentaries? And can you guys give me advice on how to be a good commentator? I love making videos and commentaries is something that I enjoy watching. So I also enjoy making commentaries as well. I have asked Vesper the Snake, my favorite commentator, for advice on making commentaries. And you know what he told me? He told me that the most important thing about commentaries is entertainment. And you know what? He is right. And it's not just for commentaries. Rants, movie reviews, commentaries, all sorts of videos. The most important thing about any video on YouTube is entertainment. It's to make content that people will enjoy watching. That is the reason why I made this video. Because I care about the quality of my videos. I care about making good content. Now, let's talk about my commentary on the Irate Gamers Mission Impossible review. You know what my goal was when making that commentary? I was trying to make as many jokes as possible in that commentary. But the problem is... I couldn't make many jokes in my commentary on the Irate Gamers Mission Impossible review. The reason why I didn't do so well in making many jokes is because the video was full of laughs. So instead of making jokes, I had to point out the laughs. I did make a few jokes, but they weren't many. Most of the video was just me pointing out the flaws the video has. That's the problem. I'm not sure if many people enjoyed my commentary on the Irid Gamers Mission Impossible review. And I'm not the one to decide whether or not the commentary was good. But I just couldn't make many jokes because I was too busy pointing out the flaws the video has. Which leads me to another question. If a video is full of laughs, what is the best way to make a commentary on it and make the commentary entertaining? I really hope that my commentary on the Irate Gamers Mission Impossible review was good. I really hope so because I did try my best to make jokes. But like I said, it wasn't easy since there were so many flaws that I need to point out. So what's the best way to comment it on a video that's full of laughs, pointing out and still make the video entertaining? I need to know because most of the videos that I am going to comment it on this January do have a lot of laughs. I need to point them out but I still want to keep the video entertaining. So yeah, every Monday I will be making a commentary. And they will be commentaries on old videos. I have already decided what videos I'm going to do a commentary on. I am not going to tell you what the videos are. You will just have to wait and see. So look out for them. That's all I gotta say people. Thank you for watching and have a great day.